Senior Night Inside Maples Pavilion, Stanford's Rachel Dawn, Danielle McNair, Nicolette McNair, and Haley Spector. It's not the last time they'll be on this floor. Remember, the Pac-12 Championships are here in a couple of weeks. Well, this night, though, belonged to Oregon State. Before we get to the Beavs highlights, Elizabeth Price back on the floor for the first time in a couple of weeks, 9925. Well, she injured her toe, so this is the first week back since then. It was strong, powerful, big tumbling pack start to finish. Her final tumbling pass, huge double pike with a great landing. By the time Oregon State got to the floor in the third rotation, they were in command, and then they blew it open. Sylvia Colosi Pelaya, career high 9-9. Well, we've watched them all season long be strong on the floor, but now it's about confidence. They're gaining it every single weekend. She was clean start to finish, and that's when the streak of 9-9 started. Isis Lowry came up with a fun, lighthearted routine with some of the best tumbling we've seen from her so far. And of course, my favorite, the reverse worm, which always grabs the attention of not just the fans, but also the judges. Next up was Maddie Gardner. Beautiful two and a half twist to start her routine. She always has great choreography, and she has been a consistent performer for this team. She delivered once again, but it wasn't over there. Their anchor coming up a few weeks ago had a clutch performance to win the meet against Utah. Well, tonight she was good once again. A 9-9-2-5 for Katiana McMillan. It was a fun, exciting rotation, and that's when we knew Oregon State was gonna win it. It was their best rotation of the year, a 49-4-7-5. It all adds up to a 197-125. That is a season high for Oregon State as they beat Stanford 5.8. The all-around, Maddie Gardner, 39-4-5-0. Oregon State goes home to face Washington. Stanford on the road at Utah.